What is good? Diamond Knight is Steve, baby. Y'all already know what's going on in this video today. Today, man, as you guys can tell by the title of the video, what we're going to be reacting to today, man. So a lot of you guys, of course, sent me this video to react to by The Voice for the People, man. So I've seen a lot of you guys spamming me, and I did see Cinco go live last night, ignoring a whole bunch of comments, talking about the situation with Brooklyn, supposedly at one point or another being pregnant with possibly his child i don't know shout out to everybody who was sending me the tiktoks and everything like that i believe once again that brooklyn is loving the attention she doesn't love the fact that her character is being assassinated all right but she's assassinating her own character by the things that she is doing and has done that is now being brought to the forefront but she is enjoying every bit of this attention that she's getting okay now shout out to all my leos out there right it is leo season ain't it is it still Leo season? Yeah, it's still Leo season. So shout out to y'all. They say y'all love attention. Now that's not every Leo. And that could be every sign, okay? Every sign could love attention. But Leo is known for, oh my gosh, I just want to be in the spotlight. And, you know, blase, blase, blah. I already know I'm going to have some upset Leos in the comment section down below. <laughs> hey, I love y'all too, all right? If you are a sign that's not toxic, I fuck with you, all right? No matter if you're a Leo, a Sag, a Taurus, Cancer, whatever you are, all right? But what I'm saying is she seems like a toxic Leo, all right? Just a toxic person in general. And she is actually adoring and loving the attention that is on her right now, you know? And at the end of the day, when it comes to drama situations, it still ends up benefiting, I can't say in all situations, but you're gonna get more attention. Even if you lose some sponsorships, brand deals, you lose some money here and there, you still get the attention. Attention equals dollars in some type of way. But anyway, guys, let's get right into the video. I just wanted to preface the video with a little bit of my thoughts. Like, comment, subscribe, all of that. Tell a friend to tell a friend until they ain't your mama, today, Uncle Joe. We still a hoe. Let's get right into the video. Let's get it. Brooklyn Fro has posted an old picture of her pregnant belly with the caption that says, IG, I'm just a liar, huh? Whole, Whole three months by myself while the father was in in nyc effing bitches three months by myself while the father was in new york fucking bitches then justin responded to and my thing is she always does the tweet and delete shit post and delete type shit right she did the same thing with her bloody nose that she did in the back seat by herself now she's over here talking about she was pregnant oh i'm the liar blah, blah, and the baby daddy was out here effing bitches and blah, 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 blah. so if that's the case why would you post and delete it why don't you stand on that shit you can't never stand on what you post that's what I hate, man. If you're going to post some shit, stand on it. Why are you posting and deleting shit? To the picture, he said, Justin responded to the picture. He said, now that I think, who kid was that for real? Ooh. That was October, I think, at the prom. Then Brooklyn posts a picture of a bull spot in her head with the caption that says, pull my shit clean out. Sure. You probably pulled your own shit out. <laughs> I'm not about to do shit. I'm not about to do nothing, bro. Well, when I think of Brooklyn, I just think, you know, the girl, not Exorcist, what's the girl, y'all? The Ring, I think of her ass, you know what I'm saying? Like, the Ring just going crazy all around the house and shit whenever she has one of her episodes. <laughs> <laughs> and look, I'm not going, I'm not, I'm trying not to really make fun of it because I know mental illness is a real thing. And I'm not there to see, or I wasn't there to see what the situation really was. But like I said, man, it's just, it's hard to believe what Brooklyn be saying. She be bringing certain shit to the internet and then want to like cry about it and play victim. You're the only reason why we're here. And you're the only reason why we're still here talking about this shit. So it's very clear that she is trying to provoke Justin, provoke a response from Justin, right? And he sees it. He peeps it and he doesn't really want to give her the attention that she wants because she so desperately wants the shit. He tried to put it behind him. And here she goes again with more allegations. So if the bloody nose thing was a fake allegation, a post and delete allegation at that, and you, you posted another one and deleting another one, do you really think people are honestly going to believe you? Once again, I wasn't there. I'm not behind the scenes, so I don't know. Whose baby is it, though? Whose baby is it out of all the niggas that we've done found out? And there's probably niggas we don't even know about that she done smash, y'all. And this is not to shade Brooklyn. This is just, you know, it, it's life. It's just a real thing that happens. I'm not judging her. But all I'm saying is, how do we know if it was his baby? His baby? Baby number two. Baby daddy number three. We don't know. 
At this point, she should go to Maury and find out. Like, we don't know whose baby it was. This nigga smokes so much. I don't know what he going through, but goddamn, nigga, fuck. This nigga's always smoking. <clears throat> Ain't nothing wrong with smoking, but damn. I don't got time to be doing that. I don't know what the f***. <laughs> I'm going to leave it at that, bro. I'm going to leave it at that, bro. All I know is I'm going to roll up this blunt. <laughs> Facts, like, bro. It's going good. You got to ignore her, man. Ignore her. Because she's tripping. That's shit, bro. That's she wants the attention. That, you ain't getting that out of me. <laughs> you ain't getting that you ain't out of me. This out of Facts though. Nah, I see him, bro. I'm just not entertaining them, bro. I feel you. I would be sick of this shit. Like, <clears throat> it's like, for what? Like, I'm not, that's not, I don't want to talk about that. I don't even want to even just. Yeah, say, bro, you about it to. I didn't bring shit to the net. What you mean? I didn't bring shit to the net. Mm hmm. That's what we now I didn't bring nothing to the net. Man, shut up. Man, stop talking, bro. <laughs> What I be making seem like are y'all really mad at me? I just be coming in my shit trying to get me to talk about shit. Yeah, I can, uh, get some views and shit on your YouTube channels. I'm just trying to go live, bro. And I'm chilling, bro. That shit, bro. Just on the other shit, whatever she got going on, whatever. I got shit to do with me, bro. If I mean, don't include me in that shit, bro. It's over, bro. I thought we been. Made five, six posts that this shit was over with. I'm leaving it alone. I'm, I'm going past it, bro. I'm not. I'm not sitting there trying to. I'm past that shit. That shit over with. There's nothing else to talk about, bro. Facts though. Post it. Make sure they see me at 1400 on the 21st. Mm -hmm. Then they can see it. That nigga said, make sure you pay your half of whatever bill he talking about. That's all you got to do. That's bro. all that's he care about. Thing. That's the only thing I got to say to, to yeah, you. I know that's right. That Fosiani, please don't let this situation <laughs> mess up that Fosiani. Because Man, I, really, look. I really do want to uh, pay that bill on some real shit. <laughs> now, Brooklyn Frost X Delane also went live and responded back to Justin. If you watched Justin previous live, he allegedly claimed that Delane slept with Brooklyn while they were together. And it's like, damn, like, how can you go f that? I call you beautiful. He call you a bitch. You Damn, like, this is crazy. Delay yeah, also explained why he called Brooklyn the B-word. Time stamps are down below if you want to skip ahead. All right, bet. I told her this. I swear to God, everything I love. I texted her this. I said, because I seen she followed bro, and I know Brooklyn, so I knew she was already, I already knew what she was on. I texted her. I said, I swear on my mom on the dead homies. If you f with bro, I, it's raps. Like, you'll never talk to me again. Oh, bro, like, we're not. I'm cool. And what? She did her big one. I seen her. I seen them at the house. Best friend. I'm like, oh yeah. Mm. Best friend. The question Say, is, was y'all still together at the time? Yeah, hey, homie. Next thing you know, magic followed me. I said, quick shit. Ah, got on it. Rizzed her up. Caught a flight. No, no. I think she flew out here first. I think she flew out here first before I flew out there. But yeah, so it was like. Depressed and shit, bro. But I was never mad. I'm never gonna be mad at no other. No. Facts. You feel me? You doing what you supposed to do? That's a fact. I'm telling her. I got. All right. Let me tell y'all. This was Cinco told me <laughs> when he said uh he hated me because I caught her. Bro. All right. Look. This mm -hmm. how me and Magic stop talking. This shit funny. <laughs> bro. All right. I went to Tennessee. I'm in a room with Magic. I think I think Brooklyn text Magic. She text her some weird shit, bro. I'm hot. Damn, homie, on my soul, I'm mad as. I, I looked at the message. Okay, screenshot them. Boom. I sent to a Cinco. I'm like, hey, bro, get your. Mm. He was like, get your. Oh, bro, like he 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 was more like good looking out on telling it, but. Why you don't call my girl no Oh my god, that's some simp ass shit. I'm sorry, man. You trying to check me about some shit I'm trying to warn you about. Your bitch is hitting me up. And you so much on some simp shit that now you mad at me for calling her a bitch. But she hitting me up 
about another bitch about my bitch like all right okay <laughs> huh? okay no delay talk shit i don't listen to nobody on the dead home I'm like, she a... <laughs> oh, uh... what? she just blocked me right now she's a what that was the reason why me and magic end up breaking up though because it's because look bro i swear to god on my life magic came to me straight facing no oh, she <laughs> said something about brooklyn I'm like she was she asked me, you still you still Brooklyn? Are you? I'm like she got a whole and she popped out with. Like what is you talking about? And that's crazy, for you to go outside your relationship and hit up your ex nigga while you with your next nigga about his next bitch. The nerve. But I guess the type of face I trying to fuck up what he got going on, what your ex got going on. I had in my face, looked at me. Like, and all she said, like, lying, like, this lust type shit. I swear to God, I ain't even know lust me. <laughs> oh, bro, I looked at her with a straight face. I wasn't finna tell her I ain't know what lust me. <laughs> pulled my phone out, went to Safari and searched up lust. Wow. I said, look, I searched up lust definition. And then I, I started reading it, and I looked back up at her. What the f*** is you talking about? This ain't no lust, nigga. What? It was bad <clears throat> from there. Boom, we broke up. No, we ain't break up, like, right, right there. But you could tell, like, that shit wasn't finna go nowhere. So, will you try again? Why y'all like to, y'all like to double back the exes? Nope. Let me, let me ask y'all something. I ain't the one. Is, is that what y'all do? Y'all <laughs> double back the exes? That's me, what she do. I'ma keep it funky with y'all. I'ma keep it a honey on the dead homies. Me, personally, I never double back to where I'll date my ex. Because... Like, what we had, that connection we had at first, that, that, that love, that, that zing and that for you, that we had, that nigga said that zing. it's gonna be different. Like, I feel like when you try to make something work for the second time, y'all, y'all break up and y'all try to rekindle shit a year later or some shit like that or whenever, that shit don't be right unless God really bring y'all back and it's right. Other than that, bro, I'm fucking with it. Dead homies. Me personally, I'll oh, shit out my ex on the facts box. what facts because me I don't, I don't really care for upping my body count so on both <laughs> yeah, this nigga said i mean that's not really she already part of your body count if she your ex so that don't even make sense but yeah i fuck around with my exes but other than that we're not being in no relationship single and i want some both in my ex up right right i'm going my ex okay. hey homies like but dating yeah, that's a no-go. Uh, I'm not going to date my ex again. Ah, uh, bang, ah. Uh. <laughs> Get that smack down. <laughs> right, beat the brakes off it. Okay, let me know in the comment section down below. Would you guys get back with an ex? And I know it's a lot of people that's going to say, yeah, you'll give them another chance or whatever the case was, just depending on the situation. But me, I feel like it's all about going forward, moving forward. You know, that relationship ended for a reason, you know. And I just don't feel like there's no need to rekindle that shit for what? For what? Like, there's always going to be better in your future, better in your future, better in your future, better in your future. That's what I feel. But you never know, man. Like he said, sometimes God will orchestrate certain things to where it's set up to where y'all meet back up in life later on or whatever the case is. And y'all make that shit pop. I ain't saying that that's not going to work out. I'm not saying that that doesn't happen every day. I'm pretty sure that happens every day to different people. All I'm saying is at this point in my life, that's just how I feel, you know? <laughs> what? Break that back down. Me saying that don't say I'm, um, let me clear this up. I'm like, no, y'all. Mm -hmm. You want to smash Brooklyn? But this shit, I'm not saying I'm anybody. I'm just saying <laughs> I'm answering y'all shit because I asked y'all a question when I said, would y'all go back to y'all exes because y'all keep asking me about doubling back and fucking with my exes and shit like that. <clears throat> hey man really good video by the voice shout out to you girl this whole situation once again like i said man it keeps getting entertained it keeps getting entertained it keeps getting brought up now brooklyn's over here complaining about her being pregnant right and the baby daddy was out effing bitches now we don't know if that was cinco we don't know if that was delane we don't know if that was what's his name <laughs> what is his name y'all dylan we don't know if it was uncle joe who's still a hoe up the road we don't know who it was at this point right so, of course, she's going to make it seem like it's Cinco, but it could be Domingo. We don't know, y'all. You know, Rodrigo. We, we have no idea. So, 
with that being said man i want to know your opinion who do you think the baby daddy was do you guys think that she was actually pregnant was that really her belly uh you know i just don't know and i honestly do not give a fuck all right if you're gonna post some shit <clears throat> stand on the shit or never post the shit she obviously wanted to post and delete. She knew people was going to screenshot the shit. And she knew this was going to be on a tea room the next day. Okay, it just is what it is. But hey, I guess she wants her attention. She wants her clout from the situation. I guess she said she might as well keep going since her character is pretty much dust at this point anyway. Right? Credibility and accountability is dust at this point. So you might as well keep it going, you know, for whatever reason she sees fit. But I'm glad that Cinco is paying her very, 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 very minimal attention so he can get his $1,400 that he needs to pay that bill off that they both acquired together <laughs> you know what i'm saying but i'm glad that he is paying her dust but anyway guys let me know how y'all feel in the comment section down below make sure that you give this video a like a comment subscribe make sure you hit that bell to be notified when i upload on my channel dm me live videos to react to and tell a friend to tell a friend to tell you ain't your mom teddy uncle joey still i'll see you guys in the next motherfucking video and i love y'all man peace we out baby <laughs>